Hi, Ivan Curtin here again from uh, <clears throat> Sydney-based parquetry flooring company called We Love Parquet. I just wanted to make this video um, quickly while I'm driving home from work, uh, just to inform you all um, on the subject of what is Black Japan or Japan Black. Well, it's a it's a type of furniture finishing technique. It's a bit like a lacquer and originally it's actually a Chinese uh, technique but it was sort of taken by the Japanese and when this type of lacquer was um, sort of discovered by the West it was held in very very high regard it was like a, this very fine sort of black lacquer <clears throat> that had a sort of a luster to it that was uh, unheard of, unseen before um, in Western society and it was very sought after. And fast forward to the 20, uh, 21st century, now, this very minute, what Black Japan is now is it's a, it's a, it's a generic way of saying that you want to stain your floor black or dark, rich brown. Um, now we can do that in a number of ways, but generally we use a uh, a uh, dye stain, which I've talked about previously in uh, in one of my previous videos. I discuss about azo dyes um, here in Australia. They're <coughs> primarily uh, Feast Watson dye stains, um, and they are a semi-transparent, um, deeply penetrating. Um, type of a way of staining floors and the you know previously to these dye stains um, coming onto the market there was a, a, a bitumen based um, black japan which was um, very good with furniture using you know smaller sample sizes you could use it quite liberally but on floors um, it was failing a lot of the time and there was a lot of problems with it so it was actually taken off the market but what they were saying to do was to apply this stuff which is a bituminous oil stain and then put shellac over the top and then put an oil a tongue oil or other type of floor finish over the top of that but the problem with this uh, bitumen stain was that it never really dried so it was always moving around there was always rejection problems peeling adhesion problems and it, it was never really um, very successfully applied onto floors <clears throat> and so along comes the dye stains which were a pretty good and reliable um, version of the bituminous oil stain but uh, lacked a little bit of the luster and the um, development of the color that the the bitumen does actually have so that's a little bit about the background of black japan uh, if you want to um, you know discuss in further detail your specific project you can uh, reach me um, at um, the website we love thanks for watching see you next time